Yeah, I don't even know if I'm gonna get to record anything today. Um, I'm intending to stream later in the day, but I gotta bring those things to UPS, USPS, and return this guy, the Fluval Filter, to PetSmart because it had a crack in it and it started leaking and I was screwed and it leaked everywhere. So I need a new one. Yeah, I did a water change yesterday. Didn't clear up too much more, maybe a little bit. It's hard to tell. It's gonna take it a while and it's gonna need a filter. That's why I wanted to install a filter. Oh man, you see these white dots? Those are Nerite snail eggs. They are the most annoying things and gummy things you can't get off your stuff ever again. It's the worst. Look at these glasses. Look at these fucking stylish glasses. Those are migraine glasses. I'm actually wearing my glasses underneath them. Not that I'm having a migraine, but they are also to prevent migraines. They're great. Uh, we're bringing packages to the UPS, the USPS. Lauren's just driving because I'm, I'm an idiot and I lost my keys. They're somewhere, somewhere at home. I keep losing my keys like a scrub. That's, that's, that is just a fact. Weasel loses his keys. It's not, not like, I'm not stating things that happen. I haven't done a cam face in my vlogs yet, in my lazy vlogs. I think it's time for a cam face, but I can't really do it with, with, with the big glass. I'll, I'll try. Yeah, I can still do it. I'm so good. I wanted to bring a lot of stuff to Goodwill, but again, that's all in the car and I'm a scrub and I don't have my keys. So, fuck me, am I right? This camera wants to focus on anything but my face. Bagels. <laughs> you excited for bagels? Yes, I am. Best bagel place bagel. in, what is this? In I the, know, this Timonium. place. Timonium, I guess? Is this Timonium? Yeah, I guess this is Timonium, yeah. Bagels. Hashtag. Hashtag life is good. Mm. Real fact number 92, fish can drown. Yes. Your, your viewers probably think that you've got like a really big aquarium thing going on. Oh, that's true. Yeah, I mean, I kind of do right now. You do, you're on an aquarium kick. I am on an aquarium kick, I need my fix. I got some stuff. Bacteria supplements. Several bags to put the filter media in. Yeah, super exciting. More airline tubing. Whoa. And a fresh filter. Last but not least, cleaning for gravel. Gravel cleaning, it's so interesting, right? Well, Ma, what could you possibly do? Oh yeah, right, swim. I don't know why when he's in this pool he forgets that he can swim. What a dilemma. You are already swimming, Mar. You could just swim over there. Welcome to Weasel Life Vlog, because Sven didn't feel like filming, so I'm doing it instead. <laughs> We're chilling at Lock Raven Reservoir. I don't know if you can hear me because there's a waterfall going by. Um, Sven's over there doing his thing, playing with the dogs. Mars flipping out because of the prospect of a stick being thrown. Get it, Jeff! <laughs> Where did it go? It's gone forever. Look at that little hound dog nose trying to figure out where it disappeared to. So we actually came down here last year and filmed uh, some pretty nice video and sound because we intended to just do some like relaxing ambient sound and music videos. Um, and we took uh, Sven's H4N field recorder and my uh, Nikon D7100 and just did some nice uh, video and sound and we never actually released it so uh, because it wouldn't be appropriate on weasel zone um, so that's what we might use lazy weasel for so you check this shit out all this natural waterfall shit relaxing as fuck <laughs> you might get to see some nice um some nice relaxing like one hour waterfall sound and video stuff coming up soon because why not have some waterfall action right now you're not focusing on me at all are you there we go oh yeah
don't want that. I don't really want that, Mars. You think I want that? <laughs> oh no, <laughs> Mar. Mar. Oh, I'm so. Look how scrawny this guy is when he's all wet. Go on, Jim, you can do it. One time, Mar spent a good, uh, good maybe five minutes or so trying really hard to dredge up this entire tree. Really? Oh yeah, no stick is big enough for that guy. <laughs> if you know what I mean. Look at me, I'm the vlogger now. <laughs> <laughs> Where did those pups go? There's one and two, hey guys. Are you excited? I, I think I hear a ukulele playing. Thanks. I know the gnats out here are crazy. Go get it, bud. Come on, Mars, Mars. Good boy. Ooh, that was her skull into my shin. Come on up, buddy. Let him get up. She will not. No, don't drop it down there. We're not, I'm not getting it. Good boy. Yeah, try to walk on the, on the, on the tree. Come on, Jem, you wimp. It's the same water that you were going through earlier. Same exact water. Do you want it? What are you gonna do, Jem? Are you gonna be brave? Sven is still looking for rocks and driftwood for his aquarium. Or possible future aquariums. And a future aquariums, and he seems to have found a large piece of driftwood. Yeah, he would need a big aquarium for it. He, need, break it down. he would really need to scrub and bake it. Uh no, it's falling yeah, it's apart. Pretty... Well, she won't go into the water, but did she slip? Yep, she's slipping. She's trying to what are you gonna do, run. Jim? Why won't you just swim? Swim, Jim! Kind of stuck there. Oh, you took that up? Yay! Oh no! <laughs> Jim, just learn to swim! It's okay! Is she alright? She's okay. She's just a little panicked. Oh, okay. Uh, Jim! <laughs> See? You're swimming. She's freaking out! <laughs> Pup over here is a little scared of the water now. <laughs> Just a little. She doesn't really want to go in it anymore. Get a goofball. Of I course. I don't need a leash anymore. I got this. It's a voluntary leash. <laughs> Get it, Mars. Good workout. For Work both of you? Yep. Nom nom bird. Morning, Wheatley. How you doing? Doing your fresh nom noms? For sure, enjoying your, I don't even know what you're eating. I can't go wrong with coffee in the morning, at least not for me. I drink my coffee with milk. Facts. This tank here, it's a little bit more settled, but now we have the filter running. It's a little bit bigger than Lawrence Fluval, but it's a 10 to 30 gallon one, so. I just hope that nitrifying bacteria will settle in fairly soon, but I still gotta wait until stuff is rooted. Ah, the waiting. And I got everything hooked up to this little system. This one is on the timer, so all everything that's hooked up to here is basically run on a timer. So I have the air pump and one light there, and the rest is actually constantly on because the timer runs all the time and the heater and the pumps have to be on all the time. Also, this little thing here, I know, hard to see right now, fantastic. If you're looking for an air pump for your aquarium, get the Tetra Whisper. That thing is, it, it's just dead quiet, dead quiet. It's a little bit bigger, obviously, but yeah, you are so loud. The top fin is so loud. I'll keep it as a backup, but yeah, the Tetra Whisper, it's also dirt cheap. It's like eight bucks on Amazon. Yeah, start, starting off strong with aquariums again. I, I can't help myself. I'm currently on a trip and I can't wait to put fish in there. Probably gonna put Zebra Danios in there, so. Come here. 
Ha, still gotta unbox these bad boys. They're from March. It's the middle of April, Weasel. <sighs> Splat, rebellious colors. The possibilities are endless. One color. I'm, I'm pretty sure there's only one possibility. Look, here's proof that Weasel drives too. It's actually fake. There's a monkey sitting behind me steering the car. I'm not steering the car. Look, look. The amazing Weasel driving a car. Yes, I do. Yeah. Oh, look at me. Do, do you even now. splash? Yeah, now you're sitting on the side. That's nice. Yeah. Fly for the no, don't film me when I'm eating. Did you know that Lauren was in two plane crashes? Something that we could uh, play some more or fetch with. Are you really? Uh, sure, why not? Let's get one. Oh, the cow. <laughs> it's so big though. You think they would like it? <laughs> That's sad. All right, so I've been recording a few episodes of Pollen. Pretty interesting game, I really like it. I wish I had a VR for this. This seems to be a really well-made game for VR, which is fantastic. Also, this background right now behind me looks super cool and incredibly professional. <laughs> I like this. Very cool look. My, my little bubble of the world. Well, I wanted you guys to see or meet Arno. Let's see if we can make that happen. You guys been asking? Here he is. Arno. The true and only Arno. Dorian. Only. Cute one. Way, way cuter than the Assassin's Creed one. He's a little pudgy. I'm, I'm over here with Wheatley. Wheatley's just interested. Oh, he's so cute. His whiskers and stuff. Mm-hmm. Oh, he's so cute. He's so cute. He must be like a year or something old at this point. I don't actually know. I'd have to I'd have to check. We got him from a breeder. And yeah, she she said he would get a little a little pudgy. That's in his jeans. The uh the brindle coat, the his uh fur pattern. She said genetically gets a little pudgy. And he is. He's he, a pretty little guy. He has a wheel, but the males aren't as active as the females and they don't really like running around quite quite as much. I know you were gonna come out, but I'm gonna go in a jog now with the dogs. Um, I recorded a few episodes of Pollen. I'm really happy about that. And I got these leaves, these, uh, what are they called? Catapa leaves. Yes, they're antibacterial, prevent parasites, relieve stress, simid fish. Um, you can put them in the tank and uh, it will release tannins and the fish love it. So that's what I'm excited for. I also got this brother label printer because I want to put labels on my tank and boxes and everything. It's just a label printer, surprisingly cheap. Um, and this better hammock. So basically I'm going to put the hammock in there and the leaf. Uh, into Grapefruit's tank, and then we're gonna see how that goes. Yes, those are some really big leaves. I don't think we're gonna need it that big. I'm gonna probably just cut off a part and put it in the tank. All right, so I broke them down into four pieces, and I'm just gonna drop one in. Hey there, hey Grapefruit. This is gonna color the water pretty yellow. It's gonna look really weird, but that's the idea. It's gonna release tannins, and you keep exploring. And I'm gonna put in the beta hammock. The idea with a beta hammock is that they're gonna lay on it because they're gonna lay closer to the surface. And since they're labyrinth fish, they like being close to the surface because they don't have to swim up so high. I've been jogging actually, 4.6 kilometers, which is really nice. I haven't jogged in months at this point, so uh, makes me hopefully gonna make me feel better. I know tomorrow I'm gonna feel like shit. I'm gonna be like super exhausted um, and all everything is gonna hurt, but it's gonna be worth it. Uh, the color is slowly fading out. I got this, whatever it's called. What is it called? Lofty Lavender. So I'm probably gonna do that within the next few days. Other than that, I was thinking about streaming, but I wanna take it a little bit easier and I just saw a game that's interesting. I'm not gonna say what it is yet, um, but you might be able to see that on the channel soon. Also, a new shopkeep is coming up. People have been asking about that. It's gonna come up on the 22nd. Anyways, I'm gonna get some noms. Let's label all the things. All the things. So, uh, I just dropped off finally all those toys for, uh, I had Goodwill from the unboxing. They're taking up the backseat of the car they for were like taking a, up everything. a month. It was ridiculous and like a table and a lamp finally. Now I'm gonna ship out Icy's hat, the Icy Weasel hat and the headset 
and uh, comics that a friend lent to me. I think I have these comics for like half a year at this point. <laughs> and they are in an envelope for half a year that's been laying on the table for half a year with address and whatnot. I just never that's got to That's the it. worst. I am the worst. So I'm gonna do that today and it's gonna be glorious. I got a letter, yay! Someone sent me a letter to my PO box from Belgium. And that's the state it came in, which is quite a, quite the bummer. Um, seems to be like really bent. So I hope it's not fan art and it's just a letter or something and it's not too crumbled up. Sorry if I open this up and it looks like that. That's how I got it. And night has come. <laughs> I'm going to try to build a mechanism with my Arduino board. I have a breadboard here so I can just try out some things. I actually, oh, I bent this. I'm the worst. Um, yeah, I'm gonna, gonna have to disassemble. This is from another silly project that was in uh, this book. Really can recommend this kit. It's kind of cool to get started. And I'm gonna see if I can do it or if I'm gonna get uh, frustrated and give up. All right, here's my Arduino project. I've been working on that all night uh, just to figure out how to use the liquid crystal display. And um, yeah, it, it, it works in that regard. Now I have to just attach the servo to the pipe and program a time setting menu, which I hope I can do. I hope I can do that. I just need to get a clock module for the Arduino because I did not realize that I would need a clock module, obviously. Uh, in other news, Jalopy was released today and I'm gonna play that right now, so I'm gonna keep this short. Uh, this is probably today's vlog. This is probably gonna be it. Uh, unless something spectacular happens between now and in the evening, but probably not. This hair up there, I gotta do something about that. It's like, it's fading, it looks horrible. I'm not even gonna show you. I'm not even gonna show you. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching the vlog. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. I'm Weasel, and yeah, this was my vlog. Bye-bye.